There are different types of ice damage to protect against. One of the most common is ice jacking or lifting of pilings. Lifting damage can occur anytime ice and water levels fluctuate. The most common cause of lifting is the tide. However, lifting damage is common in the Great Lakes region where weather and wind changes can cause smaller but more rapid changes than tides. Jacking damage can also occur on any body of water regulated by man. Repair costs are not only limited to physical damage, but also the downtime of dock facilities and time spent obtaining necessary government permits. Maintaining an ice-free zone in and around dock structures is your very best protection against jacking or lifting damage. Here on the Wisconsin River below the Weyerhaeuser Dam, uh, put up my dock in last summer. Put a nice heavy duty dock in thinking I wouldn't have a lot of trouble with ice. Turned out the river kind of chewed it up and spit some holes right out on me. So I called up Casco Marine and uh, told them my situation and they came up with some ideas for me. Okay, I used the dock mount. Um, all I've done is uh, adjust it mildly around to you know keep the ice going. Um, it's worked very well. And what they did worked absolutely fabulous. It took the ice out within two weeks. It was completely gone. Looks like it's gonna work very well.